What's up, guys? Welcome to my channel, and today we're back with some of the reaction for the Bleach Thousand Year Blood War episode 12. All right, guys, so last episode was a info dropped finally after all this time. Finally, found out, finally got to see it. She goes, Mom, and finally got to see the experiment that I was already doing from before and all. I still have some questions, like I said, how did it go? But uh, came to be, and how does he possess so many things within him? Man's a human, man's a Quincy, man's a so ripper like y'all know he's a hot like th there's a lot of thing going on you know what I'm saying with Ichigo so like what like is Ichigo like the masterpiece of Aizen or like you know what I'm saying I think I got some questions going on so I'm hoping I get that get them answered or like you know I'm pretty sure that you know Ichigo mom probably gave him gave birth to him and all and don't get me wrong bro she is a badass I was not expecting her to do that she literally was just you know, letting the freaking hollow bite her on top of my man and uh, my man. No. My girl, she literally just went at him like that. So that was pretty insane there. So, and Aizen was saying something about why did hollow choose not the Soul Reaper, but the Quincy. He, he's got his, you know, experiment going on, like I said. But anyway, I'm looking forward to it. I'm hoping Ichigo solves these things out quick enough so that my man can go and get himself a Asauchi. You know what I'm saying? The top of the top blade out there. So, yeah, I'm hoping everything works out for my man. He just needs to accept how it is. Like I said, he just had to have a good chat with his pops. He would have definitely explained it to it. And, of course, like his pops said, because the last time, do you want me to tell you? He did. I'm pretty sure he did ask Ichigo that. He's like, now, nah, whenever I, you're ready or whenever I feel like it, that, that's when I'll ask. That's what he said. So, I'm, you know, you can't really blame my man, all right? But anyway, guys, like I said, with that being said, let's go ahead and check the new episode of the... Bleach out. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> bro, I'm a man, bro. Yeah, no, clearly not. Nope. Nope. Absolutely nothing. Hey, he's... He ain't gonna say it. Clearly, wait. I can say, bruh. Uh, kind of. Almost got into the trouble. <laughs> e I see what's going on. <laughs> Literally, you gotta say that again, alright? <laughs> mm hmm. Okay, it was just meant to be, bruh. You know what I'm saying? It's just dad and mom. Is that Urahara? That's Urahara, how much you want? <laughs> hey, how good I tell? I don't know. What's that though? Urahara, what's going on, bro? Urahara? What's up? Could he tell something? <clears throat> okay, when does she not have a word? Wait, how she find? Oh, I knew it. she. The girl snitched. Yeah, I don't know. Who looks like Uryu's uh, mom. Okay, that's what she she was worried about the taintation, bro. I mean, she got a point too, to be honest. I think it's because of that. So it seems like it was the follows by the yeah, seems like it, yep. So that's what it was. That's why Uruhara noticed it too, seems like. The hell? What's up with her? What's up with her leg too? Okay, there's, there's so much going on, bro. What the hell? So, hmm. This is why it's like, let's just watch. Hello? Okay, out of fucking nowhere. Yeah, my man out here, saving. Let's get... Yeah, that was a close one. Hey, man, my man didn't do nothing, all right. It's the hollow, yeah, it seems like the wound. Yep, so it seems that's what I think. Ooh, Urahara, let's get it, boy. My man's it. Okay, it was all thanks to Urahara, the genius, obviously. All right, I see. That makes sense. 
That's crazy. Like literally, just like that, she became a hollow. Just by the hollow that that thing was, uh, Ida was freaking experimenting. Hmm. Okay. Okay, and not something that you want to meet up with. I'm telling you. <laughs> like, clearly, all right. Never. Oh, shit. Holification, there you go. But I could save her life, otherwise, she would die, okay. Well, obviously, if there's no choice, make sure she's okay, right? What else do you even have? Prevent this suicide, okay. Counteract holification. If we inject the holification soul with the vaccine made from Quincy's light arrow and a human soul. Okay, I see. I see. Here we go. Stronger. Like what? Soul? Soul? Soul represent? So it was uh, the opposite. Okay, I see. That's why. Yeah. Humans are okay. Right. We need someone who is a hybrid. You become a hybrid of sort of and human. Okay. Which means you can become. Right. Yeah, shit, this is what, bro, this is crazy, though. Oh, how is my man still able to use, it's only for, like, some time? Literally. And anyway, my man did, all right, that's why. Still, my boy, let's get it. <laughs> Didn't even think about it, bro, it's like, let's get it. <laughs> Yo. He goes, Pops is the real G, bro. <laughs> That's insane. My man had no doubt. My boy out here saving his wife. You get me? Let's get it, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, she was cool. Yo. So that's how Masaki Sama got a holification, got saved by Urahara. Could I also take this as a freaking <laughs> Isis plan? Out of fuck. That's crazy. I think she's dreaming, right? She has to be dreaming. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure he gets along with her later on, maybe. Right? That's how she on that 20 IQ. What the hell, bro? That's cool. Gotta go to the dude looking pretty cool, though. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> she look cute. She's sad, too. <laughs> Would they have Urahara? Yeah. Understandable, clearly. Yeah, she's like one of those type of girls. Like, she knows, but she won't really, like, say to your face. That's the type of girl she assumes. And she's smart, too, you know what I'm saying? Despite how she is. That's crazy, bro. Right. That's cool. That's cool. She, she, she cool. You two guys are like definitely a great couple right there. It was just all meant to be, you know what I'm saying? Is was no longer a book. Because he's been suppressing for all this time. It's broken. That's, that's why Ichigo look like that. I was talking about it, bro. The one that he went in a mode with Ukiora, you know what I'm saying? 
Yep. How did she die? Someone killed her. Killed her. Tell me. Everything but two. Got real. Yes, please. I want to know. Because I was about to snap. Here we go. She wasn't supposed to. She wasn't. She saved Ichigo. Because Ichigo was targeted. Even though she had merged with the hollow. She was origin. Without. Really? But. However. Who is that controlling the goddamn. She couldn't use it. Someone stopped it. What happened it? How? And made them his own. Okay. There you go. That's how he. Also lost her life. He's the father of the queens. There you go. So he. There you go. So if he wants. Yep. They can just. That's crazy. Even him. Bro, does it make yo this is crazy. How it all adds up is just insane, bro. I really like that. Yep, thanks for telling indeed, bro. Got a man up, but you got good work. My man's growing up. It can be so I can't see the OAG, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, obviously, you now we finally got to know how Ichigo has the holification because it was obviously because Masaki got bitten by the experiment hollow that Aizen was going around with. And that's how she had that. But the crazy thing is, obviously, it was also kind of unnoticeable, right? Because, like, I'm pretty sure she didn't really mean to, but obviously, she had to hide it at the end of the day because, you know, and it's also thanks to. Uh, you see that his mom, uh, like uh, who even told, you know, the head mom, Quincy, whatever, like, you know, she does dad, um, mom saying that obviously she's been beaten by the hollow. But obviously, like, even if despite her saying all that, like it wouldn't have worked because, you know, there was basically no way of saving her except like Urahara out there making a contact with her. It seems like he had no idea who she really was until he had bumped into her and kind of noticed that in you know, a holification growing inside of her my man like out there like not even like thinking twice before he was like okay already yeah, just go ahead like do it to urahara you know what i'm saying he didn't even take the time to thought about it because everything that urahara was talking to him about the way to save her was like basically just you know all on his shoulder like just there's no like positive anything nothing in there the only positive thing that you can think of is clearly you know her being safe so which is cool, my man didn't think twice before, like, he was like, yeah, okay, go ahead, yeah. So, makes sense. So, all this time, you know, he is, it was uh, Ichigo's dad, uh, who, like, you know, soul power that was actually suppressing the hollow, but now can't anymore. It's been broken and all. Which is why, like, uh, when uh, it was uh, Ichigo versus uh, uh, Okior, right? Uh, that's when that, I don't know what that hollow a name is but i'm pretty sure there's a name but which looks very similar to the one that bit uh ichigo's mom but the craziest thing is how like you know because she was not really like weak you know she had a pretty crazy defense like how you know ichigo's dad's talking about it the only reason that like she even died was obviously ichigo was there as well you can tell because uh she ichigo's right under her and uh, you know while she tried to block I'm assuming because like when she tried to block it with her ability, it didn't really work because, you know, Yark out there taking away her power, uh, Quincy's power and just, yeah, that's, that's crazy. But so basically Yark has like full on power of like basically all the Quincy's, doesn't matter. He can just take away whenever he wants. So no wonder. And like, I was asking like, why is he calling it your son? Like, well, well, what are you on about, bro? Like, now it all makes sense. So he's the father of all Quincy's. Mm. That's crazy, but I'm 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 glad we finally got to you know have all these answers, and I'm like I know she like she goes mom was dead. Now we also got to see how she died, and like you know how powerful your hog really is within the Quincy's realm, whatever. Like you know, what I'm saying I mean not just Quincy, man, he's powerful despite you know not just on that. So, 
But yeah, and it seems like everything was just working out the way how Aizen actually wanted to. Because uh, I thought like, you know, everything was like, you know, his plan. But like, he was like, okay, let's just see how it all goes. And which is why it, it, it is what it is right now. How it is right now. Uh, that's crazy, bro. Like, man, that's insane. My man sacrificing everything like it was nothing, eh? For her. And eh? Uh, am I glad that he actually did? Which is why, you know, she goes here. And, like, man, what a good story, though. God damn, I'm genuinely impressed. Like, everything just connects. Like, you know, everything is there. Like, hey, okay, this is what it was. Everything. So, uh, that's what I actually like about it. And now we're going to stop Yohawk. So, basically, he can, Yohawk can actually take away uh, Ichigo's Quincy's power. So, which is... Uh, a little bit of a demerit there, but still my man needs to somehow find a way to, I don't know, control that hollow that has basically taken over now. Because, you know, Ichigo's dad's soul ain't able to, like, hold it no more because it's broken. Everything's gone. So, yeah, the, okay. I mean, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's been crazy, guys. I ain't gonna lie. I think we have, like, what, the next episode, the last episode for this, uh, you know, phase or whatever. But yeah, we'll see how it goes, guys. But uh, yeah, I battled them way too much. But anyway, guys, hope you guys did like this more reaction. If you guys did, make sure you guys smash the like button. Don't forget to subscribe button and the notification bell, guys. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.